Hi and God bless. I hope everyone's having a grateful day today. In these clips, I'm just getting ready because David and I are about to go apartment hunting in the springs. So we picked out a couple apartments and in today's videos, you guys will not see all the apartments, but most of the apartments. We ended up choosing the ones that we like the most and including them in the video, but trying to keep something secret just in case we do decide if the lord wills for us to move to one of these apartments currently there's nothing wrong with our apartment but we are just keeping our options open and you know us if the lord doesn't say move we won't move if he says move we will move so i hope you guys enjoy today's video and let's get into it So basically where we're going today is going to be the same apartment complex that we are currently living in but it's in a different area in Colorado Springs. It is 15 minutes away. I did tell the lady today that we're going to see a one and two bedrooms just to see what they have available. It's the same exact layout for all the apartments here except the fact that as I mentioned in my last video that it is closer to the mountains. So we are northwest and that is on the west side it's like if you're in new york and you're uptown and then you go midtown so it's kind of that vibe in that sense of location but anyways we are excited to see what they have so we're here and this is what it looks like and as you guys can see this is their pool area Okay, so their entrance looks different and honestly, I like the colors here better. They're like warmer tone. Where we're at, it's a little brighter, I wanna say. The paintings are different on each floor. Oh, this one is staged. This one's so cute. Yeah, because it's some stage. Oh, I love this layout. This part reminds me of our old kitchen in New York. Oh, yeah. yeah, something about it. Wait, which way did you go? This this is the first bedroom. Is this the main suite or is the main suite on that end? This one? Okay. The, the double's nice. Yeah, this one's a stand up, and the other one is um a tub. Yeah, that is so cute. I love the cabinet space. Look extra. It's a lot. I mean, it's even more than what we have, and what we have is a lot. We just and then the bedroom it's kind of opposite from what we have because it, it faces like other people I guess this one but depending on what's available by the time we move It's massive. Reminds me of that one closet I had in the Bronx. This one reminds me of ours, just a little small. Yeah, I know. So that's too bad. They're all like that. Or these. This closet is also really big. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, see, this is the one with the top. Oh, okay, so the washer dryer is in here. Okay, cool. Yeah, 
this is a, the same one, just the opposite ends. Oh, you think of this layout? I like this one. I think it's a lot. I'm gonna be super comfortable family <laughs> design. <laughs> thing is that no sun hits here on this side on that side but depending on what's available for yeah. after you know How much does this unit go for? Okay. And they vary as well, like depending on location and stuff like that. It's a lot more decorated in, in this sense. And the color layouts are different. The picture. Oh, that's cute. Oh, yeah, same. Literally the same as that. Just the colors different. You have grills on the left, fire pit on the right, also fire pit table, and games like that mountain view is insane from here. Yeah. Different pictures. Yeah. Are these all one bedrooms with garages? What does the rent go for for these? Is this the bedroom? Like it's much smaller. Even the mirror. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, I want to see it in the in the balcony. Okay, so it's, it's smaller than the one we have, correct? Correct. Okay. Such a pretty view. Yeah, that's the dog park. Yeah. There's no one below you too, or above you. It's pretty big, the garage. And then they have this little area too, is where the staircase is. Right next to me. 
So coming out of the apartment complex, this is the view and we really liked it. What did you think about it, babes? Ooh, nice. It was nice and quiet. It was super quiet. Great, Not saying that ours views. isn't quiet, but it was just a different kind of quiet. I don't yeah. know how to explain it. I feel like ours is definitely smaller. Look at these. I think these are actual homes. Because ours, there's, there's just a lot of rooms like around it. There's only like this road, that's it. Yeah, this is like their main road and then the one behind it. But this is such a pretty little drive. You're so close to work. Yeah, oh yeah. It's, you're right there. I from the last apartment, I saw one of the buildings. You saw one of your your job buildings? Yeah, I saw it right there. Because you can see basically Academy, you can see Pulpit Rock right there. That's so funny. You can see a couple of buildings in the university. So we are on our way to the next box. We saw two places so far, and they're all again within our home area. So this one is eight minutes away from the other one, and this is actually like say eight to also from where we live and this is just a little view so you guys can see what this neighborhood is looking like same thing you know typical mountain views facing front which is west north is this way so like i said everything we're looking at is northwest slash west these are right here and we'll be showing you those in a little bit so these are the next ones that we're looking at. As you guys can see, it is right near the mountains and we literally live like five minutes away from here. This is around where we took Gigi to the vet and if you look to the right, it's the amphitheater. So I don't know. I love all the syrups. You saw that? <laughs> okay. Oh, that's so cute. Look at the little nook area. Yeah. The marble's beautiful. Yeah, it's nice. It is. I'm a sucker for a good marble. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. You know, I should start utilizing something like this more because we have it. I don't even utilize it, and I need to because I'm always on the computer editing. Oh, okay. So that's all the time. We got a view to get set up. So they're off school, but we can. Okay. It's nice, it's up, so you get a view. <laughs> <laughs> nice little view. It's pretty. The workout, yeah. It's bigger than the one where we're at. Yeah. Yeah. Are you guys looking mostly in this area? Yeah, we're looking north, northwest. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you have elevators, correct? Yes. So you can take the elevators for as well? Okay. 
That's so rare. I find that the apartments in Colorado Springs don't have elevators. In New York, we have elevators yeah. and walk-ups. Yeah. I think it's because, well, I also walk in Colorado. You have four levels, you have to have an elevator. Square feet. This is the biggest one bedroom? Yes. How many square footage is it? Eight? Uh, eight and how much does this one go for again? Uh, this one is starting more around. Um, the eight, three, I think. So without the This is the sunroom that you were talking yeah, about. And then the smaller ones, those are the ones that are like 16, I think, right? Yeah, so. Okay. I mean, this island is massive. Oh, look, this is like their little mud area. That's a good closet size. Look at the bedroom. It connects like ours. It's wash and dryer. Yeah. What do you think? It's nice. It's just an older model for the washer and dryer. Like they do we have now. So they have sunrooms and balconies. There's differences. I really like the layout yeah. of this. It's, a, it's a very open space. It's similar to a home. Yeah. Oh, so there's two. Okay, yeah. Two entrances to the bathroom. This one is 2050 right now. This will be the bigger floor plan. Also, the small floor is going to be the Okay. It's really big and wide. The, the little ones are here. It's a little smaller than the other one, but it's just the walker. Alright. Let's see the other bedroom, see if it's bigger. The next room is over here, right? Yes. Um, I feel like I haven't seen this in a while. Look, this has a little vault in view on this side. I knew this one was gonna have this. I feel like this is giving me work. <sighs> See, none of the, win the windows here, there's none of the mirrors open here in New York. They all open up. Yeah, that looks good. So the washer and dryer is right next to the kitchen. It's a little area. Oh, 
Oh, she's right. They are different. Yeah. This one's not as big as the other one. But it's, I mean, it's still really big. Yeah. It's a little good size, but I see what you mean. It is smaller. And this one is 16? Uh, yes. This reminds me so much of our room. Yeah. The other room. Yeah. It's kind of smaller. Okay. The closets. Good size, still it's smaller good. than the other one, but size. look at the view. Oh, this is the front, like where we came yeah. in. Some people may think this is expensive, some people may think it's not. I mean, for what you can get in New York, you're definitely not gonna get any of this for these prices like a new yorker one bedroom starts at 17 18 now if you're newly renting depends if you've been there for years and that's a whole different story because you can have a hookup family members could live there or whatever but um you're not gonna get all these amenities the pool the gym uh washing dogs and all that stuff it's just not gonna happen it's just it's rare like you're gonna be paying in the real far two to three thousand dollars so we're here so this is the little area i'm recording this with my camera but i keep going back and forth from my phone to my camera i don't want to make anyone feel comfortable so i just like use the phone for now oh okay this space here is our resident lounge it's open with our leasing office so monday through friday 8 30 a.m to 5 30 p.m and then on Saturdays, 10 to 5. Okay. We've got a corner pocket um, right over there, pool table, and some some more TVs. As for you, they just kind of come out, hang out. Lots of times the residents will come through, just pick up their morning coffee, get to work, or um, yeah, hang on the weekends, you know, with the pool and TV. So, is our resident lounge quite popular? Of course, we have our pool. So, the pool is open year round. Water is heated. It's open year round, we have a hot tub there. You can kind of step up too. So it's open year round, just close on Wednesdays for uh, maintenance, water levels, and everything is all good. Okay. Uh, but it is open 10 to 10. The building is our fitness fitness area. So this first room here um, is our spin room and guided uh, workouts. You can actually select a program on the TV. Do a guided workout. We got the garage door feature you can open. That is oh, I just oh, noticed that. Yeah. That's so cool. So, yeah. So that way you're not like trapped in. And so nice. lots of openings, lots of windows, of course. And then this is the fitness center here um, with all your cardio, free weights, free cables, um, and all that stuff. We've got stair mats and all that stuff. We get to look at the mountains while they're working. Yeah. yeah. So you can yeah. even take your weights off to the curb. Yeah. It's nice to cool down and like the sun is still shining. Oh, it's I just so realized that this yeah. open. Yeah. Station, first come first serve, resident. I mean, with all the amenities. Right. Open for residents, just come by, utilize. Um, yeah. <laughs> the people's spa. Yeah. So all the open parking. It's all first come first serve for all the residents. Okay. The garage. Okay, yeah. yeah. If you have a garage with a drive, with a driveway, um, I'll just park right here. Then you actually are able to park in your driveway okay. as well as in your garage. So yeah. you're given two. Yeah. You're given two. Yeah. Um, personal parking spaces, which is awesome. Look at the back here. This is going to be 
our two bedrooms. As you can see, the private patio is in the front. Right. Yep, you can kind of set that up. Some things people, uh, some things residents do is kind of put a tension gate, like a walkthrough tension gate, you know? Right. Um, that way, if you and your dogs are hanging out in the patio, yeah. so you don't have to worry about putting them on a leash or... That's nice that it's allowed, them. though. Yes. That's yeah. really nice. As long as you don't screw it in, and people just like zip tie them, tension rods, zip ties. This is so them. pretty. So yeah, so this is our low model. Uh, it's a medium size of the five two bedroom units that we have. So I'll let you both explore. Uh, you are given granite countertops, bathrooms, the built-in desk space, as well as, um, yeah, all the cameras. Yeah, they're, no. the, they're the only ones that have the soft walls. Oh, Everywhere no. we've ever checked, Everywhere. no one has it. Our, our apartments had it in New York, and here we're like, I have to get used to it because I was like, oh my gosh, I'm banging everything. Lots of storage, and then the pantry you have in this floor which is nice. Oh, we have one like this. Stainless steel appliances in every unit. So you can definitely expect the color scheme of everything, the floors, all of that in every unit. So a nice feature we give roll down shades. So you have roll down shades. That's nice. Line. Again, a lot more cleaner aesthetically in this. Yeah. Which way did he go? This one? Right, yeah. <laughs> Massive. <laughs> you played no games. You went straight here. <laughs> it's very modern. You can expect all the high ceilings throughout every level too. So first, second, and third, you're given all this high ceiling, which is awesome. Bedrooms are carpeted with this ceiling fan. Um, so that's nice. Oh, it's nice. It's it's carpeted. Yeah, I do like that. That's a nice touch. The I like when the toilet's separate from the shower. Oh, wash and dry. It's a, it's a nice little, little thing. Oh, this That's the awesome thing. With our two bedrooms and two baths, like we don't have the bedrooms side by side. You know how yeah. like some two bedrooms yeah, are like, yeah. all yeah. and it's just like exactly. wide. Like this. Yeah. All of the two bedrooms and two baths, and all of the floor was fine. Right. Yes, yeah, they're not sharing balls. It makes it a really good yeah, open space. This is a nice little size. This is a good size. Let me see the closet. Look. Here. What's what's uh, it? That would be the detached garage. In our buildings, the garages are pretty long. Oh, okay. So we do have detached garages that are more standard, they're a little more shorter, but they have okay. a single court just like this. Um, but yeah, with the attached garages, you get one in your attached uh, with your home. Yes. It's, you can expect a very long, yeah, a large garage. This is going to be the second largest. Okay. Um, I don't have a small one to show you, but it sounds like you guys want to kind of up, upsize. Yeah. So these are the two great options. This is 823 square feet. Look at this. Great. So if you're close to it, it does. You're living, you know, you kitchen area, you got a kitchen area, you're living in the high. Right. You're still given a large patio. It's so large, though. Yeah. Just slightly bigger yeah. than what you have. And then the one that we'll see, the shine with a den, that one is 961. So I didn't expect it to be like this, no. this side. The washing dryer. Should we see? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, it still has its own little space. Oh, this is so cool. It's like a hotel. Like a little hotel. Oh, Oh, that is, that's really cool. And it's a double vanity. Yeah. And you find, yeah, it's a double vanity that's a 10 foot counter. Yeah. And then oh, you're getting both shower options. Yeah. Standard shower and a tub shower combo. 
That's impressive. Yeah, I wasn't expecting yeah, that. Yeah, I wasn't. <laughs> yeah, that was typically like, yeah, the selling sign. It's like you were the first one. We, <laughs> like, we do a lot of like walkthroughs, tours, because especially when you're apartment hunting, there's so much that you're looking at. And sometimes they all just blur into one. So yeah. Did you see, look, there are garbage disposals at the sink. Mm -hmm. So you keep it open. It's big. Yeah. This is the bacon we have. Modern French stores. See, with this space, you're getting a little more like a real living room. This, this one kind of reminds me of ours. Okay. Yeah, and walking around the balcony there, you can see it's just as large as the one bedroom. I mean, that's the best What's this little area for? Like okay. that? Yeah, you can kind of create your own space, whether you want to do a small little dining room. <laughs> yeah. Do, you know, make it your office space, you know, an option. A plant room, I mean, really? Yeah, <laughs> the plant room, that's true. <laughs> that their one bedrooms have a double vanity whereas oh. where we're at right now unless you have a two bedroom yeah, then that's the only way you'll get a double vanity look at this the tub in the shower, shower. Tub. Oh, yeah. there's the balcony look look at the closet That is it for today's video. I hope this video kind of shows you different rent prices in Colorado Springs, the type of neighborhoods and stuff like that. As you guys can see, and as I had mentioned in my video previously, the more north you go, the more expensive it gets. But honestly, guys, these prices are not that expensive for this mountain view. In New York, you'll be paying for a box and it'll be like $2,000. And you don't get half the stuff you get here, as I was mentioning before. And currently, at the moment, we are paying less than $1,500. So I'll leave it at that. But what I will say is, if you are apartment hunting, I would suggest moving during, I know it sucks, but moving during the winter time because we moved February, end of February, we were here March 1st. And because of that, a lot of these places in Colorado Springs had specials. We had a whole month free of rent. And there's many other locations that do that too. There's a lot of incentives. People love incentives. And since people are not moving around that time, that's why they need to make the incentives so people can want to move and want to rent out places. So I will say that a lot of these places, they did mention the same thing to us, which is such a blessing to move during that time, like February, March, because it is the colder winter months, depending on where you live. And... It will be less expensive so that's just a little tip from me to you and let us know in the comments below which was your favorite we personally loved the first one the third one the fourth one but the sixth one was our favorite so let us know what you guys think i hope that this video blesses you if you are someone who's looking to find an apartment in a different location and you want to get out of where you're at and you're just curious about prices and I guess maybe what it's like to live in Colorado Springs then this is the video for you I pray this video blesses you in every video to come bye guys